Mr. Blue 
something really scary and scream at him in a horrible, horrible scream. So every time a train comes by, I'll give you a big one, two, three, and everybody go, ah! Let's try that. One, two, three. Versus evil. Now the bad guy is going to be played by my brother. Oh, what? He doesn't want to play the fiddle now just because it's haunted? All right. Then it's going to be played by my other brother, Billy. Give me a Billy! And the good guy will be played by me! Good. Now, uh-oh, my fiddle's back there. Now let me explain the rules here. <laughs> Take your time, Billy. Now we're gonna, we're gonna, what we're gonna do is every time the hero comes out, I'm gonna need you to go, yay! All right, so let's try it. One, two, three. Yay! Okay, now it's very important that you do that because if you don't, he could lose to the evil bad guy. We don't want that to happen, do we? Okay, somebody over there said yes. Who was it? <laughs> that lady right back there. And I thought we had a relationship. So here it is, ladies and gentlemen, the story of good versus evil. Oh, I forgot. This young man saw him on a fiddle and playing it on. The devil jumped up on a hickory stump and said, Oh, let me tell you what. I guess you didn't know it, but I'm a fiddle player too. And if you care to take a dare, I'll make a bet with you. Now you play a pretty good fiddle, boy. You can't be down there too. I bet a fiddle of gold against your soul, because I think I'm better than you. The boy said, My name's Johnny! But I'll take your bet you're going to regret because I'm the best that's ever been. Johnny Rosin, a beauty boy, play your fiddle hard. Love hell, go to St. George and the devil. And if you win, you get the shiny fiddle. opened up his case and he said I'll start this show and fire flew from his fingers tips as he rosined up his bow and he pulled the bow across the strings and it made an eagle hiss 
and a band of demons joined right in and it sounded something like this. Oh, no, no. 